Picture a world not as a globe, but as a flat disk. Sounds intriguing, right? That's what the flat earth theory proposes. This theory isn't a new phenomenon, but rather an old belief that has found new life in the digital age. It's a perspective that challenges everything we've been taught about our planet's shape. Now you might be wondering, who are these flat earth theorists? They are individuals like you and me, who are convinced that the earth is not a sphere, but a flat plane. This belief isn't based on whimsy or fantasy, but on what they perceive as concrete evidence. They point to a range of observations and experiments, all suggesting a flat, not spherical, Earth. So, what's the evidence that has convinced so many people that our planet is not a globe, but flat? Hold on, we're about to dive into it. Flat Earth theories believers rely on a few key pieces of evidence to support their claims. Let's delve into these, shall we? First off, the horizon. The argument here is that no matter how high you climb, the horizon always appears perfectly flat to the naked eye. It's a compelling argument at first glance. If the Earth were truly round, wouldn't we see some kind of curve? But remember, our vision has limits. We can only see so far, and the Earth, my friends, is a whole lot bigger than our field of vision. Next up, the claim that aircrafts don't adjust their flight paths for the Earth's curvature. The idea here is that if the Earth were indeed a sphere, pilots would have to constantly dip their nose down to follow the curve. But that's not how gravity works. You see, gravity pulls everything, including planes, towards the center of the Earth. So, an aircraft in flight is always being pulled towards Earth, which naturally follows the curve of our planet. And then there's the grand conspiracy. This is where things get really interesting. According to Flat Earth Theory believers, NASA and other government agencies are part of a massive cover-up to hide the Earth's true shape. The moon landing? A hoax. Satellite images of our round Earth? Fabricated. It's a theory that thrives on skepticism, on the idea that we're being lied to on a global scale. But here's the thing. The more complex a conspiracy becomes, the more people it needs to keep it a secret. And let's be honest, how likely is it that every astronaut, every scientist, and every government official over the past few decades has managed to keep this massive secret under wraps? These are just a few pieces of evidence flat earthers use to argue against the idea of a spherical Earth. But how do these points hold up under scrutiny? The flat Earth theory, as we've seen, is built on a number of interesting, albeit controversial, pieces of evidence. It's a concept that's captivated many. The theory's advocates argue that our planet is not a globe, but rather a flat disk, surrounded by an ice wall. They point towards unique interpretations of horizon observations, flights paths, and the behavior of gravity as evidence. However, the flat Earth theory is not without its critics. The scientific community continues to uphold the round Earth model, supported by centuries of empirical data and experimentation. Critics argue that the evidence proposed by flat earthers often overlooks or misinterprets fundamental scientific principles. The debate doesn't seem to be settling anytime soon, with both sides holding their ground. Whether you're a believer or a skeptic, one thing is certain. The flat earth theory certainly makes for a fascinating discussion. What's your take on it? 